It could be for single brothers too. Well, yeah, the single brothers they need help too, right? <laughs> We're the worst out here sometimes. Come on now. <laughs> yeah, and you know what? You mixed, um, you engineered this track as well, David, and the baby music one. Yeah, well, like I said, this ain't my 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 show but tonight. <laughs> no. No. Well, I yeah, gotta. we all, we all. There's a bunch of us that chipped in on oh, uh, yeah. working this record. This you is know? definitely yeah. a team effort. I'd probably be sitting somewhere, be like having somebody else saying, "Could you move that knob? <laughs> Could you do this? Could you make the sound a little warmer? Mm-hmm. Could you turn the highs up on this? Could you, you know?" Which is what I did mm-hmm. in a big part of my career, you know, because I've had some great engineers in my time period, mm-hmm. which led to me once I've gotten all this technology going on, you know, it's all memory stuff that what we've gone through i'm just like doing what maybe bob brockman might have did or 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 uh, a carl Beatty, or or many of the other engineers that have been you know in my life mm-hmm. that i just kind of remember so i can't even imagine if we didn't have talking software where i would be mm. and uh music because i like to really sit down and grab something to make it sound the way i want it to sound you know what i mean mm-hmm. And then, of course, we, we, we bounce off of the artist, you. Cause she, let me tell you all something. <laughs> this girl over here, she knows what she wants. <laughs> and you turn that knob the wrong way, she's like, uh, David, uh, uh, I, I, I think it should be a little brighter here. And the, the, loud, the, the voice should be a, loud, a little louder. I'm like, hey. You know, so we had our little struggles for a little <laughs> while. <laughs> I'm like, really? Okay. <laughs> Grab the knob and turn it up for her because she knows what she wants. So you kind of, you know, probably next album she's going to be mixing her own record. I don't know. We'll see. Who knows? Who knows <laughs> right now? <laughs> We're a team, and the team is rocking. I hope y'all are it digging is. it. I hope y'all are liking it. Tell me, y'all y'all digging it? Come on now. What's I'm happening out there? thankful for that team, too. That's a beautiful team. <laughs> uh, we got some comments coming in. What's going on out here, Zamir? What's, what's, where's your girls? Where oh, your girls man. at? Listen, we have we have like forty six people watching right now. Really, if they yes. y'all stay on board, because y'all right now, this is one of my favorite joints coming up. I gotta scroll up. There's a lot of comments. Shalom, everybody. I guess. Well, listen. Now that y'all on board, <laughs> on deck, y'all got to hear one of my favorite on this album. This song now. Y'all probably going to be like, oh, he old school, so he like that old sound. I don't know <laughs> what it is about this record. Excuse <laughs> me. But I played it before on my show. I snuck it in there on y'all. It's called Trouble in the Flesh. Mm-hmm. And the name of it gets me right away. Before I even hear one word, I hear Trouble in the Flesh. Mm-hmm. And I hear what we be going through, guys. Mm-hmm. Y'all know the deal. So I'm going to give it to you the way she gave it to you. All right? This is Trouble in the Flesh, y'all. By Zamira. Hey. 